friends, today we're gonna draw Easter Girl. Yeah, we hope you're gonna follow along with us because art is always better with... Friends. Friends, like yeah. Like you. Yeah, like you. <laughs> you need something to draw with. We're gonna use markers, some paper, and... Something to go with. Yeah, let's start. Yeah. Let's first draw our Easter Girl smile in the middle of our paper. Then we're gonna draw her eyes. I'm gonna draw a circle over here and a circle over here that matches, same size. I like drawing the left circle first because then it's a little easier when I move my hand over to draw the same size on this side. If you're left-handed, sometimes it's easier if you would draw, you draw this one first. Does uh, that make sense? Because mm -hmm. then when you move your hand, you can see this circle. All right, let's keep going. Let's draw a smaller circle inside. To make it cute. Yeah. <laughs> then we're gonna color in the big circle and leave the little circles white. Then what should we add next? Eyelashes. Eyelashes. Cause it's a girl. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna draw two this time. One, two, three. Oh, okay. One, two, you always three. gotta add one more than me. <laughs> <All right. laughs> now we're gonna draw her face. I'm gonna start on the left side. I'm gonna draw a U shape that comes under her mouth and then back up on the other side. Then let's draw the top of her head. We're gonna draw an upside down U. We're gonna go up, over, and back down on the other side. Oh, it's a little flat over here. That's okay. We're practicing. Most important thing is... Have fun. And, and to... Practice. <laughs> okay. Now let's draw her hair so she doesn't look bald <laughs> like me. I I'm gonna draw a line that goes across like that for her bangs. Then let's also give her a headband, and this is for her bunny ears. Bunny ears, yeah. We're gonna draw another curve that comes up over her head like this, and then back down on the other side. You don't have to add bangs if you don't want to. Yeah, I guess so. You could, yeah, draw it differently. But I would. <laughs> okay. <laughs> now let's draw her bunny ears. I'm gonna draw an upside down U over here, and an upside down U over here. Two bunny ears. There you go. And then one more. One bunny ear. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> she needs two. And then we're going to draw that same shape inside, but smaller for the inside of the bunny ears. Up and back down. We're going to add more hair later, but let's draw her dress next. I'm going to draw two little lines down for the top of her dress first. Then let's connect it for her waist. And I'm also going to draw another line across her waist. All right, let's give her a dress. We'll draw two little lines, two diagonal lines coming out on each side, and then we can connect those lines too. All right, let's draw her feet. I'm going to draw a U shape on the left and also over here on the right. Kind of looks like a ballerina bunny. It does. <laughs> it kind of does. <laughs> Then we could draw her shoes. I'm going to draw two lines, one on each leg. Okay, now let's draw her arms. I'm going to draw a little arm coming out to the side and then back up. And then we'll do the same thing on the other side. And we want to try to make these arms look like they're the same length. Sometimes that's challenging. <laughs> oh, let's also draw her neck. We'll draw a little U shape right here under her chin. Okay, now we can draw the rest of her hair. Let's start up here, and we're gonna draw a little line in between her ears. And then we're gonna imagine that line going behind the first ear, coming out to the side like this. And we're gonna draw it coming down further. We're gonna stop over here on the side. Then we can do the same thing over here on the right. We'll draw us, imagine that line going behind her ear, coming out to the side, coming down. Now you could draw short hair or you could draw long hair. I'm gonna give her a little bit longer hair. On each side, I'm gonna draw the lines down further and then we can connect them. We're gonna connect them underneath her arms. This has got pretty long hair, huh? Mm -hmm. All right, Hallie, we did it. We finished drawing our cute Easter girl, except she's not completely done. We still need to do one more step. Yeah, we need to color her. This part we're gonna fast forward, but at the end, remember, you can always pause the video to match our same color. You ready to fast forward? Yeah, yeah. You guys 
guys can pause the video right now to match our same coloring, or you could color your drawings. Anyway. Yes, any way you want. You could change the skin tone. You could also change the color of her hair. Or her dress. Oh, yeah, you could color her dress. And oh, purple. Her, oh, yeah. What, what else? And her headband. Oh, her headband to match her dress. Mm -hmm. We hope you had a lot of fun drawing your Easter girl. Yeah, we do. We hope you had a lot of fun, and we'll see you later, art friends. Goodbye. Goodbye.